having an amazing day today. I am so excited to do this video. I feel like it's been forever, but we've just been on our honeymoon and we've come back and I kind of went full throttle into work. So I finally got some time to sit down and do this video, which is all about Noosa Do A Dive. So before I waffle on too much, let's get straight into it. Perfect, so one of the main things that we wanted to do when we went to Bali was actually do some diving. So we were qualified many years ago. We did our qualification in the UK and we've been diving so far only in Dominican and then this was our next time in, uh, this is abroad anyway, the next time we went was in New Stuart, Bali. So we had a look and kind of researched loads and loads of dive companies. This one repeatedly kept coming out the best for what we wanted and also where we were located. Because our first hotel we actually booked specifically to go to this dive center and it was in Nusa Dua and we actually stayed at Amaterra Villas. Absolutely stunning. I highly recommend you get your own gorgeous private villa with a pool and an outdoor area. It's absolutely stunning, but I'll do a separate video on that anyway. So a really friendly driver comes and picks you up from your hotel. They took us then to the actual dive center where we went for a few bits of information. So we got there, went through all the bits of paperwork, got our equipment ready, packed it into the car, and then the driver then took us to Padang Bay. Now we did again a lot of research on where we be best what kind of things we'd see at different places and it was quite a drive so it was probably about an hour and a half something like that to get to Padang Bay from the dive center but trust me it's well worth it and once we got there we popped our stuff into the little restaurant that you actually have lunch at and then they drove us just you know a minute down the road to actually get to the bay and once we got there we got settled into our gorgeous little boat they are so cute i think i've never seen anything like it before and they're really really comfortable so if you're bad with seasickness like me <laughs> it's really helpful because these ones where they've got the two kind of side bits it allows for you to have a lot more of a steady journey so we specifically chose Padang Bay Blue Lagoon because we really, really wanted to see if we could turtles as well as sharks and different things like that. But turtles, to swim with turtles has always been something we've dreamed of. And I'm so glad we went there because we saw so many turtles. I think we saw about seven or eight turtles in the end, which was unbelievable. Honestly, I... Still to this day, it's one of the most incredible things that we've ever done and we've ever seen and I feel so, so grateful for that. So, when we got there, we went on this boat and it took us about half an hour to get to the Blue Lagoon, which was our first dive site. And when we got all our kit ready, we went straight down in. The instructor was absolutely fantastic, so really put us at ease because we haven't done a dive in quite a long time, probably about three years, something like that, over lockdown. So I was a little bit nervous if I'd remember things, but he was so, so helpful and gave us a lot of confidence. But as soon as we went down, my mind was blown. <laughs> they speak absolutely fantastic English, explained everything to us. And as soon as we went down, we just had the most incredible time. We saw turtles, we saw um, clownfish, we saw loads of different tropical fish, loads of different, um, we saw, now, <sighs> I'll show you a picture in a sec and you'll see it, but it's kind of like almost like an eel. Um, I'm not sure if that's what it is. I need to try and have a look it up. If you know, let me down in the comments, uh, let me know down in the comments below. That'd be amazing if you could let me know what it is. But it was absolutely incredible and it was sticking out of our second dive, which was at the wreck. But our first dive, we saw manta rays. We even saw a shark. I can't believe it. It was amazing <laughs> with its little baby as well. You can't really see it that well in the video, but Honestly, it was insane, it was incredible. If you are taking a GoPro to film as well, I recommend putting on the red filter. You will get everything a lot more bright and a lot better than if you weren't to have that filter. They're not expensive, so I highly recommend chucking one of those on. So with the price as well, it includes absolutely everything from a gorgeous lunch, we had such good lunch, so it's usually kind of like a rice dish. Um, I'm vegetarian, so I had the vegetable version with kind of like egg on top, and Dean had a chicken version absolutely beautiful that's all included drinks as well your transportation from the hotel if you're in a certain area and also 
all the equipment included as well, which is absolutely fantastic. So after we'd done our first dive, which was around 45 minutes, we then came back up and we had a little bit of a rest, because obviously you can't dive straight away after you've come back up. So when we did go back down, we did the wreck dive, which again, I highly recommend because as if you are a diver and you've been to anything where um, there's a wreck, you tend to see a lot more life. So you see wonderful fish, all different varieties. You tend to see an abundance of marine life and it's absolutely incredible. So I highly recommend doing a wreck dive if you can and if you have the time. But definitely going that little bit further over to Padang Bay, Blue Lagoon, absolutely stunning. Loads and loads of turtles, as I say. So if that's something you've always wanted to do, highly recommend going there. And another great thing as well is it is so accessible with regards to cost in Bali. So you really can have a wonderful dive. It turned out for us to be about, but as you know, prices change, so I can't really say the exact price at the moment because things might have changed. But for us, it worked out about a hundred pounds and we got two dives for two people, including lunch, equipment, transfers, and everything like that over to the Patang Bay area. So absolutely brilliant i highly recommend and a fantastic company we felt so confident from start to finish not getting paid to say this <laughs> i genuinely honestly we had such an amazing time and when we go back we will definitely be seeing them again to kind of explore some different areas but i think we'll definitely go back to Badang bay like the blue lagoon as well because I still can't get over what we saw and the clarity was absolutely fantastic you can do snorkeling and things like that as well if you're interested in that but if you can dive, there is nothing better. <laughs> but let me know as well in the comments below. Me and Dean are really interested in obviously traveling the world, doing diving in different spots. What is your favorite spot that you've ever gone for a dive at? I would love to know that. Pop it down in the comments below. If you haven't done a dive before and you're looking at this maybe your first time, again, it's great there because they do do courses. If you haven't done it before, they do paddy instructor courses. They do everything there. So they'll be able to cater for if you've never done it before or if you're a seasoned diver as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. We had the most incredible time and I can't wait. I think next time I will be going through the quad biking that we went on. And I think that was one of the best things again we've ever done in our life. So <laughs> keep your eyes peeled for that video. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I look forward to speaking to you in the next video. See you soon, bye.